Hey y'all, it's your girl Brittany. I'm back. I'm better with another video. Make sure y'all subscribe to the channel, like the video, click the bell to be notified of every time I post because I do post frequently. All right, y'all, y'all already know what we're doing. Y'all already know what it's hand for. We jumping, we skipping, we hopping, we leaping, we doing a duggy, our duggy, duggy into this video. Click the link down in the description box below to become a member on my Patreon. I just did a, um, a review of Glow Realist album over there. I got my thoughts on her new album. And I also did the BT Hip Hop Awards, something like that, over there. Um, it was a key. It was a cackle. Go over there and watch shows. All right, y'all. Without further ado, let's get into this video. So, I've said it numerous times. And I feel as though it has came to the light and... You know, a lot of people who did not want to see it are now seeing that Miss Tasiki. And is it Tasiki or Taseki? Cause I could have swore when we when she introduced us, she said that's Tasiki, and everybody called her Taseki. Like, which one is it, Taseki or Tasiki? Which one? So mind y'all, as y'all know, Biggie and Natalie got into it, baby. It was. It was bad. They got into it real, real bad. So, in the midst of them getting into it, now it's like, I'm going to show you. I'm going to show you, Biggie, that you're beneath me and that you will forever be beneath me. And she wasn't playing. She really was going to show Biggie that Biggie was beneath her as, as she felt as though she was beneath her. Like she said, you're beneath me. You will never be a part of what I got going on. Never, ever in your life, on your life. I don't like you. Uh, as we know, Biggie tried to get out of place, get out of pocket, get out of body with Nelly in the club a few days ago. And Biggie had forgot her place. So what Nelly did, go to the person that Biggie feels as though is her security and will protect her and will baby her to the end of time. Which is Tussinki. That's Tussinki. So what Miss Nelly Nunn did was something I feel as though is very genius. And in my opinion, Tussinki played right in the palm of Nelly's hand. So Tussinki lets it be known that she is on the baddies yet with the baddies. As we know, Natalie, Scotty, Jayla, Roly, they're like the top tier baddies. So they get on the jets, the, um, you know, and the other girls just fly commercial or they take a bus or whatever the case is but no ma'am so natalie was like let me go and start putting belt to ass around here let me let you know that i could take your friends and i could really just make it hard for you i can make it to where you're by yourself so she puts tzatziki on the jet with the baddies and no shade, baby. Tasiki is eating it right on up. She is happy-go-lucky. She is loving it. The fact that she sat up there and recorded everybody lets you know she's not used to being on the jet. Now, she did end up posting that this wasn't her first time on the jet. But, girl, this is your first time, like, filming on the jet, like, being on the jet with the baddies, in my opinion. When she showed it, the jet looked it very old. It was very outdated, boo, boring. But this time, you know, you're on the upgraded jet, and you're with the baddies pose for me. And you could tell that you've never been on here with all the rest of the girls. So, girl, you happy to be here. Like, no shade. You're happy to be on the jet and i don't think anything is wrong with that but just tell it how it is so i'm guessing tzatziki has started feel, feeling bad and you know feeling as though like dang i got on a jet i'm having the time of my life and my friends are on the bus oh <laughs> my friends are on the bus being big bags and i'm over here on the jet being pampered they're asking me what would i like they're letting it you know be known do i want a steak for dinner type of timing do i want an appetizer you know what i'm saying like they are really treating me like the queen i am i am finally getting the recognition that i deserve and the thing about it is like i do feel as though tzatziki is supposed to be here you know because out of all three of her and her little friend group biggie anna and her she's the one who does her job like she is the most popular out of all three of them if anything when we see them, we're really looking for her. No shade. And, I mean, Anna, I would say, is in second place as far as doing her job. And Biggie comes in dead last. Nobody's done Biggie. But I feel as though Tzatziki has 
always shown her hand as far as letting it be known like she's not getting into any of their fights but we do know you know when it comes to honor she does make some type of exception here and there for honor but when it comes to biggie she makes no exceptions for biggie she won't even pinch anybody for biggie nor like argue with somebody for biggie or anything most of the time when it comes to biggie tzatziki is telling biggie like i don't think it's that deep yeah and she be talking to her like a child for real like I don't think it's that deep. Like, it's, it's not that serious. Like, I think you're just being overdramatic. Like, sis, calm down. Yeah, you got to stand up for yourself. But in this right here, this particular situation is not that serious. Like, that's how she talked to Biggie. But, like I said, the opportunity has came for her to finally truly be, like, a baddie. Really get the full baddies experience. I do believe that Tasiki is tired tired of playing the background and playing house b girly i think lo like deep down in her soul she want to be a house a girly she feels as though she's up there with them so she should be in the same in the same vicinities as them not just in the bookings but when it comes to transportation when it comes to the house when it comes to everything the shopping sprees whatever she feels as though she has earned her spot and low-key she probably does feel like Anna and Biggie are holding her back to get the get certain gifts or to get certain experiences because she cool with them and when Natalie said hey I need to teach Biggie a lesson do you want to be a part of it Tasiki said yes absolutely whatever lesson that needs to be taught teach it to her give better ass and give me um my spot and like I said, Tasiki fell for it, and Tasiki was so happy to be on there. She's so happy to be on the jet. Like, she's recording everybody like she's not used to being on the jet. And that's how we know she's not used to being on the jet. And she's happy, finally, that they're recognizing her as a top-tier baddie now and not just the eater. I think, you know, a lot of times she does want to be taken more serious as a baddie and she does want to venture out of her little friend group and not just be with biggie and anna so after you know she recorded everything she showed um them doing the baddies pose for me thing she continues on to say that she misses anna and biggie now why you miss them do you actually miss them or are you just talking because it's giving you just talking you missed them all of a sudden. Be for real. You was not missing them. The only reason you missed them now is because you off the jet. You got your experience. I don't think you necessarily missed them. I think you just felt bad because they weren't on the bus with you. And it was going to look fake for you to be on there. And you knew you was going to get backlash. So you sat down went ahead and said, oh, I miss my friends. Like, I, I want to be back with my friends. Girl, you do not want to be back with your friends. It looked like you was having the most fun out of everybody on the Betty Betty Jail. And like I said, once again, it's perks of being top tier with Natalie. Like, as much as Natalie said when her and Scotty got into that little altercation on how much she has to go through in the back end after Scotty whooped her, you know, even with Scotty Dog, like, they said in the back end they be having a whole bunch of stuff to deal with because Scotty want to bring that dang on dog everywhere, which I understand. I'm a, I'm a pet parent, too. So, I get it. You know, you, you want to have your animal with you um but once again like i said they've had so many people be like well she want to bring her dog i, I want to bring my dog i want to do this i want to do that you know and she has to deal with so much in the background so i just believe that you played in, play into natalie's hand i feel as though you really didn't feel bad for being on a bus i mean being on a jet which you shouldn't y'all all grown but I don't believe as though you felt bad. I don't believe that you even missed them. You, I don't even really feel like you thought about them while you was on there. You was eating lobster, shrimp, you know, steak. You was having you a good time. They did a scene. You was just happy to be in the scene with them. No shade. I, th I think it's more like that on your end than you playing this role i think you just played into the role because you knew you was gonna get some backlash because everybody already say like somewhat you disloyal and you you disloyal like you don't have no what's the word i'm looking for like you loyal when it's convenient you might be friends with them but you don't have their back like you should have a back you don't you don't feel as though you owe them that 
So, like I said before, I don't feel as though you felt bad or you really missed them. I think reality started hearing the fans was going to say something. And the fans had might have had already started saying something when you had posted that you was on a jet. And that probably started getting to you and you started seeing that. So, you was like, oh, I miss them. I miss my sister and them. But in actuality, you did not miss them. You was happy for this opportunity. You was happy to be upgraded to first class and not having to sit in the common area with the commoners no more. You feel as though you deserve this which i believe you do too um you feel as though you deserve this and you should have been happy so you just gasping in the experience and you just happen to be the part of the experience whether it's because biggie was doing too much or not so yeah that's all i got for y'all in this video make sure y'all subscribe to the channel like the video and click the bell i'm gonna see y'all the next one bye